I definitely don't think that it looks appropriate for what it should be. If we want to actually bring business in, we need to make some changes here aesthetically. And if Jefferson City approves a tax increment financing plan for the owners of Capitol Mall, they say there is a lot to look forward to. We are going to touch every piece of the development. Uh, everything from, from paint to facade changes inside of the, of the building, starting with the exterior of the building. Uh, it needs modernization. The, the entrances uh, need need updating. Jefferson City's TIF Commission recently said yes to a plan to get $10.6 million in tax revenue to the developer for a mall facelift. Here's how it works. Farmer Holding Company would put up the $37 million to renovate the mall. Then, the city would rebate the $10.6 million to the mall through tax revenues generated by increased sales. The plan would increase the sales tax on items sold at the mall by 1% for 40 years, meaning goods there will be slightly more expensive than elsewhere in town. Interim City Administrator Drew Hilpert says the city really has nothing to lose. If we did nothing, the city would receive the same amount of money. If we do something, in theory, the city will receive more, but it won't receive any less. The city council will vote on the TIF plan at the first meeting in November. In the meantime, the city wants to hear from the public. Is it worth it? Chris Shepard, KRCG 13, Jefferson City.